What up, peeps? Your girl, D. Kennedy. My bad for leaving you guys last. But uh, we saved the best for last. You know, the other thing, too, is, is because Scorpio Cancer Pisces, you are a water sign, which is emotions. My fiery ass. I'm not about that life. So that's why I leave it for last as well. But the best. Oh, this one wants to come with you. So we doing something a little different here. This is the Star Seed deck. So they want you to know that what's being cracked open let's see the earth is being cracked open for you what else the lost lands showing you the lost lands are going to be cracked open for you and show you a message Stop. because those your star brothers Horus the third eye is talking to you as I blew it over how am I doing that's not nice. Unbelievable. Because you do have star ancestors and you need to think bigger and see the bigger picture. Because you need to see clearly through, like the clear seas of Mintaka. Because the inner earth is opening and pulsing for you, giving you the clues, giving you the answers, boo, because you're not for everyone, so you need to water your garden, meaning you have your own skills, your own way, your own talents. You need to water that. You need to cultivate that. You need to respect that and work with that in order to grow that in your garden. Like you would grow a garden, literally, of what? Strawberries, fruits, vegetables, a new earth, because a new earth is opening up for you. It's going to show you this karmatic relationship so that way you're able to see through. Because you are a star keeper and you need to jump through the portal. Okay, what is a star keeper? Meaning starkeeper meaning that you know what to do you know and harbor the knowledge in order to do things in order to see things through and with that knowledge you're being asked to jump through the portal ba -da -da. you're being asked to jump through the portal jump through to the next level Ooh, that's what they asking of you sorry I got excited because you're being called to do so hey and that's why I be the excitement baby you're being called to do so and you're being told that by the way things don't happen overnight you need to take baby steps but the portal is opening and you are being called because there is a great severing happening with the planet of mars the planet of war there is a great severing happening and things are going to be shown clearly to you because the earth is being activated for you Okay, and the good and the bad is going to be seen and cut through because you are a child of the cosmos and this is the whale and the orca card, meaning you need to shine your light bright. You need to be you and you need to go forwardly through with all your might because you are an empathic starseed and you are entering into this earth school. <clears throat> so you are going to be given a breath of the cosmos, which means universal knowledge, understanding, things that you never knew before. Because they're going to show you and make you understand that all paths lead to home. And that the weight of the, even though the weight of the world is on your shoulders, bitch, you are not all alone. Because you got the love with the hydrogen energy. One moment. fishing skills okay because you are not for everyone all right that's not a bad thing you're not for everyone and your life is a canvas and so you're gonna paint of it and make of it what you want and you are going to be revival revival revived by this blue good job and you are going to be revived by the blue light flame 
which is a spontaneous awakening and it's going to activate you this blue light okay and this blue activate light activation is going to give you deep cellular healing and this is for mid may and on mid may and june and beyond and so because you are a golden child and you are a hather meaning you got the love you have unconditional love and just like that other card said, baby steps, it says right here, you need to wait. Because we have the seven star sisters here, spirituality, synchronicity, signs, birthing of something new as a sister, birthing creations, expression, tapestry of life, like the card before it. Your life is a canvas. Now, I brought out the angel deck to do a little bit of clarifying for you. Water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, or if you're... Stalker watching, boo! The city, whole city hears me at this point. But you know what? I live in a city, number one, number two, since I don't have a microphone because this is not professional. Um, I need to talk as loudly as I can so that when my pe motherfucking people can hear me. Because you are wishing upon a star. You are wishing upon a star for your foundation and your stability to come quickly and be stabilized very very quickly and it's gonna be so stop worrying my g like i said with this eight of earth here this bitch is gonna come right around back to you like the infinity sign my dear with this earth pentacle money material physical realm situation is up here also as a sign virgo taurus capricorn just saying doesn't have to be what it is but this is about money and like i said as a person only because here is now a night this is a person and the mofo is on a horse as quickly which as quickly as he comes in he goes out but this is going to balance you out because you are the queen of earth you are reliable dependable stable and independent woman Didn't I bring down the sun? Oh, because the star was here. So you're wishing upon a star, and as soon as the sun appears, you're going to get all that you're wishing and wanting for, my dears. What, baby girl? That's amazing. You are doing such a good job at that casting. Because, you know what? You do have a little bit of a conflict here, a little bit of a, what, what do we like, how do we like to explain this? Now, this is a lot of passion and a lot of fury. So we have a little bit of conflict, a little bit of conversation, a little bit of disagreement, a little bit of elevation, a little bit of misunderstanding, and a little bit of irritation. That's what the five of bonds means, fire, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. But the thing is, is that this, all of those aforementioned adjectives, uh, meaning, but that's going to lead to some change up in this mo. And what's going to change? Something's going to change with this lover, possible Gemini energy. It's going to be communicated. And this third party. That's what's going to be changed. Because you are, you are the magician. You are wanting and wishing. You are whipping up shit in your kitchen. But the thing is, is that you are ready to go. You are ready to glow. You are ready to blow. And maybe blow some dick. Moving right along. Thank God my kid did not hear me. Now. You have all of the elements that you are ready to use. Literally, that's what the magician means. Also, a sign of Sagittarius, Gemini. But just saying that you have all of the elements within your disposal and you will use them together at once or however you pleasure to get what you treasure. And that's that. All right, so I'm going to stop there before my daughter keeps interrupting me. There is some communication about to come back around to you, baby. Because that's the eight and that's the air. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, they appear. We got someone coming in and out. We also got communication coming in and out, no doubt. But that's going to lead to an ending with this 10 here in the physical earthly realm. Physically. No longer up in your ear. But actually up in your physical realm that you can see and feel. Okay, so I'm going to stop there. Thank you so much for watching. Your girl, D. Kennedy. Please like, share, and subscribe. And ring the top bell three times to get notified. If you give a fuck, your girl, D. Kennedy. Elevate yourself. Bye.